This year's Kamehameha Schools valedictorian is a star student and athlete with a deep connection to his Hawaiian roots. Yeah, our very own Jennifer Robbins is here with this week's High Achiever. This triathlete enjoys gearing up for courses across the island. There definitely is a lot of adrenaline while I'm participating in races. Stay focused on the race while remaining calm. Nakoa Ferrant keeps on track from triathlons to cross country to soccer. He's also a 4.4 grade point average student. He's a humble student and he's always so mellow that you wouldn't think that he's juggling so many things. The Kamehameha senior is proud to represent his school and to continue his family's legacy. So my mom actually graduated from Kamehameha and then my brother just graduated a couple of years ago and now it's my turn to graduate and in a couple of years my younger brother. With Nakoa's roots right here in Hawaii, it's helped spark an interest in preserving the Hawaiian culture. I've grown up out on the North Shore my whole life. This fish pond, Bokoea fish pond, is in Haleiwa and so I've kind of, kind of volunteered over there over the years and I really wanted to find a way to give back to it. Nikoa hopes to discover a way to restore the ancient pond so it thrives once again. Just seeing fish ponds and taro patches like extending from like mountain to the ocean and that was a truly beautiful picture and that's like what I would kind of hope to see again in the future. Teachers say he is not a fish out of water when it comes to conducting sound scientific research. He's gaining so much experience, research experience, that most students wouldn't encounter until college or even graduate level. The ancient Hawaiian fish ponds date back like close to 600 years, and this particular fish pond is 400 years, and so what they kind of were were sort of ancient refrigerators, and that's why the Hawaiians were able to sustain themselves so well for hundreds of years. Nakoa is going to Harvard to study chemistry, but he doesn't want to be away for long. And then graduate school, I'm hoping to eventually work my way back to Hawaii and either it'd be awesome to work in fish ponds in the future or even possibly as like an environmental manager here. He really does exemplify a student that has embraced his Hawaiian culture and his heritage. And he says he has his late grandpa to thank for that. Pure native Hawaiian, so is a very important role in my life. I definitely feel like I have that strong connection with him and saw how he cared for me. So I just kind of feel that love and think about that when I'm kind of going through hard times. A snapshot of Nikoa's life shows his dedication to his home, his family, and his school. That is why he is our high achiever. Jennifer Robbins, Hawaii News Now. Wow, that's great. Uh, if you know of a high achiever, make sure to nominate him or her at hawaiinewsnow.com slash highachievers. Your exceptional student may be recognized on Sunrise along with receiving a cash prize of $200 and LEAP financial training from Hawaii USA FCU.